Oh, hello there. I heard you love that video about division. So I thought I'd make another one, only this time focus on some word problems. Because you know, I know what you're thinking. If I have this calculator, I don't even need my brain. Well, you know what? You do, because you might have to interpret a remainder. And let me tell you what I mean. Most of the problems you're going to see on the EOG are going to be word problems, like this one about adorable puppies. So let's read this one and see how we can use our calculator and our brains to help figure out what to do here. Let's see. It says there are 33 puppies at the pet shop. Five puppies can fit in each kennel. How many kennels are needed for all of the puppies? Well, let's think here. I noticed that we've got a amount here of puppies and we're, that we're putting them equally into equal groups in all these little kennels. So I know I'm dividing. And I remember that uh, I told you last time that we need to use the INT divide button. So let me do that. I'm gonna type in 33 INT divide five. So that'll put my 33 puppies with five puppies in each kennel. And then I'm going to press enter and all oh, six remainder three. Well, I don't know what six remainder three kennels means. If you want to ask the six remainder three kennels, someone would look at you like you're crazy. Well, I know we're going to need six kennels for the puppies and six of those kennels are going to be full. But then I bet this remainder, this three right here, that's going to be three leftover puppies. And we can't have the puppies just running all over the store. So we have to do something with them. What do we do? Oh, we could put them in an additional kennel. So it looks like we're gonna need six kennels that will be full. And then we're gonna need one more kennel for those extra three puppies. So that would mean we would need seven kennels for all the puppies. So notice with my calculator, it helped me do the first part, but I had to use my brain to figure out what six remainder three actually means. I had to interpret this remainder and now, oh, this remainder means three extra puppies. We can't have them running all over the store. We need one more kennel. So six full kennels plus one extra for those three. That's going to be seven kennels. And that's my answer. Hey, calculator. It was great working with you. My brain and your calculation, we're going to rock this test. Great job, everybody. Bye-bye.